Hi, I'm Ashikul Aman from Accounting Celebrity. Welcome to my channel. Here I upload couple of accounting tutorials weekly. Today here our topic is limited company account. So here I'll show you today how to prepare journal entry to issue bonus share. So let's get started. Okay, today to prepare this journal entry will follow a question which is taken from Cambridge A level accounting first paper okay so before we start let us have a look at the question on the screen c limited statement of financial position at 31st december 2020 is shown with comparative figures at 31st december 2019 we have information for 2019 and on the left side we have information for 2020 okay so here we have some informations and we'll take these informations to record a journal entry here for the issuance of bonus share okay so let us have a look at there once again so we see here ordinary share 1800,000 in 2020 and it was 1200,000 in 2019 okay and here we have adjustment number four on 1st july 2020 the directors made a bonus share issue of ordinary shares okay and five there are no other changes in the share capital during the year okay so no changes in the capital so it is uh, 1800 in 20 okay 1800,000 okay 1800,000 dollars in 20 and 1200,000 dollars in 2019 okay so here how much increased in 20 it is 600,000 dollars yeah so here in the question written that there is no changes in the capital other than issuance of bonus share okay that means this is the amount of the issuance of bonus share as there is no changes in the capital means ordinary share capital okay so here company can issue bonus share from different types of fund okay maybe from the share premium maybe from the reserve means general reserve retained earnings or other reserve okay so here in the question we have share premium in 2019 it is $220,000 written earnings at 20 we have $401,000 and uh, in 19 it is $624,000 and revaluation reserve we have uh, $300,000 in 2020 there is no in 2019 okay so from this fund company issued bonus share okay but which one is used here i'll show you later okay so before that we should know when the company issued this bonus share okay let us have a look at the questions once again so here adjustment number four on first july 2020 the directors made a bonus share issue of ordinary shares okay it is first july so company issued bonus share on first july 2020 okay so here year ending is the financial year will be ended on 31st December 2020 but before the ending of the year company issued this bonus share on 1st July 2020 means in the middle of the financial year okay that means here we have information on 2020 are not relevant to calculate the bonus share here okay so company issued bonus share based on the fund given in 2019 in the question okay so here we have in 19 in the question ordinary share is twelve hundred thousand dollars okay we know that uh, share premium is two hundred twenty thousand dollars and written earnings is six hundred twenty four hundred dollars and the devaluation reserve is not there but it is in 2020 so we will not consider to 2020 okay so here we got the amount of bonus share which is six hundred thousand dollars okay now we have to take this six hundred thousand dollars from these two funds from this two amount given in 2019 okay so what is the journal first of all we know if liability is increased liability will be credited okay if liability is decreased the respective liability will be here debited so here written earnings is a liability share premium is also a liability for the business yeah okay so here we will take the six hundred thousand dollars first of all from the share premium then retain earnings okay so here in the question share premium is two hundred twenty thousand dollars 
So first of all, we will use that amount. Then rest of the amount will be taken from the retained earnings. Okay. So what to write here? First of all, the date. So the issuance date is 2020 and it is July 1st. Okay. So here, when company issued bonus share and the amount is taken from the share premium, which is a liability. So now this liability, the amount of liability will be here decreased. Okay. That is the reason now share premium will be here debited. Okay. So let us write here share premium. Okay. So here share premium is $220,000 debited. Okay. Then here, so $220,000 already taken. So here we need $600,000. So $220,000 taken from the share premium. So now how much left? It is $380,000. So we need more $380,000. Okay, so here in the question we have written earnings which is $624,000. Okay, so rest of the amount will be taken from the retained earnings. Okay, so let us write here retained earnings to be debited. Okay, the amount is here $380,000. Then what to write here? We will write here issued. Share capital, yeah. Okay, let us write here issued share capital. So share capital is a liability, it will be now increased. So increasing liability will be credited, yeah. So now we will write here six hundred thousand dollars. Okay. So by the way, it is thousand. Okay, triple zero. Here also triple zero. Okay, don't be confused okay so this is how you have to prepare the journal entry okay here in the question it is not clarified from which fund the bonus share will be issued okay so here the bonus share amount is six hundred thousand dollars so we manage two hundred twenty thousand dollars from the share premium and three hundred eighty thousand dollars means rest amount rest of the amount we managed from the retained earnings yeah and issue share capital will be here increased yeah in 2019 we have seen that it is eighteen hundred thousand dollars which was twelve hundred thousand dollars in 2019 okay so very good so recording of the journal is over we have to write a short note on this journal entry okay so what thing we, we can write we can write here bonus share amounting six hundred thousand dollars had been issued okay so any convenient note you can write here no problem okay so this is how you have to make journal entry for the issuance of bonus share okay this is very important topic in your limited company syllabus this is all about your today's lesson i hope you enjoyed and you understood this lesson if you think that this video is helpful for you please share with your friends so please consider subscribing to my channel because there are other so many accounting tutorials for you those will help you to learn accounting to understand accounting okay so that is all i'll see you soon with new video until then bye bye and take care